All right, we're back with Game Battles Live, bringing you the finals match. We saw a really close match with Envy and AOX go down. AOX took a hot lead, winning 4-0 early on, but Stainville was able to backpack for his team and bring him into the 2v2 Search and Destroy finals, where they're going to be playing Hype and Rewind of Second Nature. So we're going to kick it off right now on Search and Destroy in Karachi. In the booth with me, I got Patrick Bodybag Murtho, one of our site admins and commentators for GB Live. Patrick, how you doing, buddy? I'm doing great. Thanks for asking, Twiz. Glad to be here. I'm glad you're here. So we're kicking it off right now. We're going to start our player cam off on Team Envy. And it looks like uh, Hype just relayed over us that he said his hands are shaking. He's never played on live. Well, don't worry about it, buddy. Nearly nobody has played on Game Battles Live, as this <laughs> is our first time ever doing it. So, hey, Patrick, you got any complaints with me watching Stainville? Because he's been hot. No complaints whatsoever. I'm, I'm over here watching Rewind. All right, you're watching Rewind. Let me know how he does this. We got the player cam on Stainville. He picked up the bomb as usual. If you guys were watching the semifinals live stream, you already know his marathon lightweight class, and he runs for beats. It's nothing new, and he's either going to do a fight out in Cafe and get one of those two stuns. Four play takes out hype. 2v1. Stainville's going to get that plan off, and already Envy is coming out the gates hot right now. So let's see what they do. 45 seconds, you guys know on the bomb timer. Remember, seven and a half seconds to the fuse out there if you're not a search and destroy pro out there. Four play takes out the line. And what, Patrick? Did he wake up himself? Because four play, I don't even think he had two kills at all last game. Nice kill. That was a solid shot. Nothing scrubby about it. Using, I, I prefer the red dot over, but let's not get in an argument about that. As Team Envy takes it 1-0. You gotta give them props, they did just play this map and they did well, they beat AOX 4-2 on it. As we keep the player cam on Stainville, let's not jump into third person by any means. And once again, he's running. Whether he's got the bomb or he's defending Patrick, he's always running. What do you think about that? Yeah. You know, I, I, not to interrupt you, but I just noticed that Rewind and Hype, they started out with a P90 and M16 combination in round one and they quickly found out that that didn't work probably, so they're, they're changing it up and they're using some new weapons here. Looks like uh, Hype has an AK-47 and he's got the bomb. Uh, right now I got Rewind on one screen. We've got Stainville on the player camera. They both have Marathon, they both have Lightweight, and they both have Ninja on there. So not only are these guys going to be quick, they don't stop running. And they're both quiet with Ninja. Minute 44 seconds left. Stainville's got his eye on A. We'll switch the player cam real quick over to four play, and it looks like he's got a good eye on B from here. So kick back to Stainville. Let's see if we can get some action going down here. Rewind is playing slow. They kind of might be a little bit worried, you know. They take that. They come out strong. Four play takes them both out. They take that early 1-0 lead. So let's see what um, let's see what they can do. They're slow. I don't know. I don't know if I like the style of gameplay. I it, it's it's a little too slow. I, I want hype to come in there. Guns yielded. I realize it's search and destroy here, but he's about to get taken out by Stainville. Stainville needs to turn right to see him, and he's got him with a nice stun and a grenade for good measure as a nice Call of Duty 4 trick. You can never go wrong when you throw the stun. Pause him and chuck that grenade. So real solid move by Stainville. Had it down like a pro. 53 seconds left on the clock. All they are is one kill away uh, on Rewind, which is right up top, and Stainville sees him. And foreplay helps clean them up with good communication as they both got on there, realized that the bomb was at A, and let's watch this round winning kill real quick. And foreplay on the top of the roof, right above where Stainville was posi positioned on the player cam. And I gotta switch it to foreplay. Didn't think we'd have it on him at all last game. We didn't. Time to watch him. Let's see what he can do. Same bell as always. Like, what is up with this? Do you think that's a good strategy to keep using? I guess it is working, Patrick, but Stainville just hauls off and plants at B. I mean, that's been their common offensive theme, but it seems to be working for them. Yeah, you, you know, it's very interesting to watch these two teams play because, you know, these guys are creating the strategies. And it, 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 we don't know what the, the, the proper strategy is, and these guys are making the proper strategies. And it seems like, you know, they like to be high, they want to get the high ground, and they're constantly on the top of the building so they can see everything that's going on there. So foreplay, a little bit sloppy shooting, but does take out Rewind there at the end of that. 1v1 right now, 30 seconds left on the bomb time. All he's got to do is defend it. He's going to listen for a plant or a defuse right now, and Hype is going to move in. And a gun battle, Hype takes out foreplay. Plenty of time to defuse it. So it is going to be 2-1 as SN Second Nature gets their first point on the board here on Karachi. So, I and that's know. awesome. That's, I mean, that's what we like to see, too. I mean, we, we, we didn't want to see anybody get run over 4-0 here. They're, at least they're putting up a fight here. It's 
I'd be surprised if we didn't see that in the final time. So close one right there. 2-1 going in right now. Let's back out. Gotta love the Modern Warfare 2 spectating as we put the player cam on Stainville. I think I'm going to be switching for him in a minute if all he does is runs up here, plops down, and camps out for two minutes. As he's getting taken out by Rewind with the P90. Watch out for it. So all we got is four play right now. Sitting sad and lonely, 2-1 as Rewind with the P90 takes out four play as well. So quickly he went from 2-0 to 2-2 right now. And this is a close game, uh, just like we would expect in a finals match. That was a little bit sloppy shooting. It looks like he might have got a little bit of assistance on that one by height. But, hey, I'll take a kill any way I can get it. I'll tell you that much. So 2-2 two -two tied up in the series. Going to switch the camera over to Stainville. And they said, hey, guys, we're not going to run the B this time. Let's try going A, switch it up a little bit. See if he lands that stun. Nope. So he's going to hold on to his other stun. He doesn't have scavenger. He's not going to pick it up off of anybody. So he's got one stun, one grenade. You know he's going to hold on to both of them and use them at the same time. So instead of Patrick this time, they slowed it down a little bit. What are you thinking? I, I think that's a smart thing to do here. I think they need to slow it down, see if they can take out one guy. If they take out one guy, then it's going to be the, so the whole map's going to be theirs. The whole round will be theirs. So minute and 50 seconds on the clock. They don't have to rush. Just want to let you go. Ryan's right there to the right. He's going. Gun battle. And Ryan wow. takes out Stainville after Stainville had some sloppy shooting. And that is uncharacteristic of him. By all means, he should have had him. He knew it was a can spot and rewind again. P90s, both of Team MB to take him out and bring him into a 3-2 lead. So a match that started out in MB's favor, 2-0, has quickly turned tied. And now we're looking at a 3-2 match with second nature in the lead. Didn't think it was going to happen. And, and MB was hot on Karachi last map. They're going to have to switch it up. Let's switch our player cam over to second nature as we do, Mark, right have our volume working on both sides. So switch it over, and we're going to watch Rewind as second nature, and let's see if he can do anything. They're looking good right now. He's not carrying that P90, though, right now, so who knows? Which is interesting. Shoot, I mean, he took out both, in both rounds, took out both players with that P90. I don't know about you, Patrick, but I would definitely be carrying that. Yeah, it's clearly a strategy here. I mean, he's on offense. He wants to get up high and see if he can find the defenders and take them out. He, he obviously doesn't want to be on the ground here with his P90, so, you know, he's on the highest place in the map. You can see three-quarters of the map from where he's at if you're watching Rewind here. It's a really nice spot. And this is a clutch spot right here where he's at. I mean, anytime you're up at the top and you have height advantage over the opponent, you're always in good shape. You never want to be shooting up when you can be shooting down, I'll tell you that much. Rewind just keeping an eye on target A there as it looks like a stun was thrown in his direction. And he should be escorting right now, um, and it looks like... Hype has the bomb right now, I assume. There's only two players. He's got it. So I'm wondering what he's yeah. doing right now and what's the plan. So it looks like you saw Hype on the player cam right there with Rewind. It looks like they're going to slowly move into A. Good map strategy. They got the lead here. All they need to do is lock it up with a comeback right now. Man, I can't believe this right now that it went from 2-0 to 3-2 as Stainville with a FAMAS takes out Hype. Hype might have lost a little bit of health with that jump. And right it was there. a silent FAMAS, so he, you know, but, but Rewind is up high, so he saw where the bullets came from, so he does know where he's at. Lower level, and he's going to keep an eye on that bomb. I, I, I mean, and Stainville obviously knew that he dropped the bomb carrier right there. So let's see what Rewind does to get down on that bomb. It's looking like Envy should be able to come away clean with this and tie the series 3-3. And wouldn't that be great to go into an overtime round here? And, and really get things shaken up. So like you said, it looks like Rewind does have a general idea where Stainville was, was shooting from and came from. So he said, I'm done with A. I'm going to go for bomb real quick. And Stainville takes him out with a FAMAS. So Stainville, like we saw in the semifinals on Karachi, is stepping his game up. Let's watch this round winning kill with shot in the back. Not the best way to take out the opponent, but you'll take it any way you can here as it goes into overtime. And whoever was it, Patrick, tell us how that overtime works. Uh, whoever has the most kills is on defense, so since Stainville had, uh, had the most kills, Stainville and 4Play had 7 kills, so they're ending up on defense here. And Let's what, what's the really nice here is it doesn't look like anybody's carrying here. Everybody's pulling their weight, everybody's getting killed, so it's not, it's not lopsided. So everybody's a, a team player here, so it's nice. Stainville taking a little bit of damage. We're going to switch our player camera over to him. He is in another vantage point right now overlooking A. He has slowed his gameplay down. He is still rocking Marathon, but he was running before. I mean, he was, he was not. So he's got Stop and Power Pro on, and that's working out for him as he takes out Hype. So 
Second Nature, they played a heck of a game so far. It was down 2-0, come back to take it 3-2, and he ties it up 3-3, and now they are down one they're down one guy right now. Rewind is the last man standing, but Patrick, I will tell you, he's got that T90 silence on, so Stainville's going to have to watch out for him. He does have the bomb as well, if you are wondering out there. Hype was not carrying the bomb. Rewind has it, and let's switch our player camera over to Rewind right now. He is our bomb carrier, and it's going to make or break it on him, so who better to watch other than Rewind with a minute and 17 seconds on the clock? Let's see if he can get anything done here. I don't know. I'm a little, I'm nervous for him right now. You know, like, there's nothing worse than that gut feeling. You lose it. You lose the game 2-1. I mean, you just feel like the only man in this world right now. I really don't know what's going to happen. And certainly jumping off and taking some health damage is not going to help his cause. As he sees him, and Stabil takes out real wine. I'll tell you, it made it a lot easier when you jump off and you had half damage down there. Let's watch this round winning kill. Stabil gets in position. Nice through the wall, hits him, stands up, takes him out, and not only is that your round winning kill, that is your game winning kill, as Team Envy takes Search and Destroy Karachi to go up 1-0 on the series, and it looks like we're going to be watching Terminal, once again, my favorite map. So Josh, once again, tell us what teams are going to be doing what, and we'll get this going. And listen guys, I promise for all you viewers out there, we will make sure that I do not start the wrong map up this time again. I can promise you that much. We are playing Search and Destroy on Terminal. Map 2, loaded up, settings ready. And right now, Josh Scramble Wing, our video production assistant, is talking to both teams. We're going to figure out who's top, who's bottom. MV did get to pick first game, so it's going to be on second nature. And what did they decide? Still deciding, huh? All right, fair enough. I'd take the time on this. You're down, and this is the finals match. I want to give a quick shout out to some of my premium admin staff, Dimos, our online tournament supervisors, and our universal premium admins, Nitro Pete System and Seth Minerva. How you guys doing out there? Thanks for all your hard work you do with the online tournaments. So let's see, Patrick, talk to me a little bit, my man. What are they going to do on Terminal? And the, uh, they were pretty hot on Terminal. What do you think they're going to have to do different, and what second nature going to have to do? I think, I think, again, I've been preaching it all night. I think the offense team has the advantage here because two of them can go one way and the defense has to split up. I think they want to try to control the middle of the map. And as we saw last time, they were rushing, I think, the A bomb site pretty quick there because uh, they, they felt that they could get there quicker than the defenders because the defenders were coming up that escalator and the offense was able to get in there quicker. So I think they're going to they're gonna rush plan A is, is my uh, theory here. That's what, right that's what Team MB's plan is going to be. One last question before we start this match, Patrick. Who do you want to watch? I think we, I think we should watch Stainville. I think we should, we, the camera should be on Stainville because I think he's going to do work. Sta Stainville is going to do work and the words of Patrick Bodybag Murtha. So we're going to put our player cam right on Stainville. And I'm completely going to agree with you on this one, Patrick. This guy's done nothing but work the entire time. So we're going to go bottom and spectate Team Envy. So we wait for our players to get in the room. A little bit of delay there. We got them both. Stainville's in. Four plays in. And Stainville, your objective bomb carrier. If you see Stainville, Stainville picked up the bomb. He's rushing, he's rushing the center right now. And look, he's already in a plant. So he's, always. He won in there quick, didn't he? Yeah, always. He's he already, just like I said. I knew he was going to do it. You got there him down. I mean, shoot. At least Stainville's not playing you, Bobby Bag. You got his number, don't you? <laughs> so Stainville with a solid plan. Again, he is their objective bomb carrier always, even for Team Envy, and he's doing good. As Hype takes out Stainville with a P90 and Josh four play follows up with Hype with a beautiful M4 shot, takes him out, and quickly Envy goes up 1 0. Let's watch that round winning kill. It's always good when you're next to your friend and uh, you can help uh, take him out. Switching sides. And we, as we know in Modern Warfare 2, yes, you do get extra additional points and can level up quicker by avenging a teammate. So sticking on Stainville right now on defense, he's going to slow it down. You see him put on stopping power instead of lightweight. Smart idea. Still got Marathon. He doesn't ever want to stop. Like he's terrible. There is no reason why Stainville shouldn't have had that shot on him. He had him in his sights, and he better at least follow up with a kill there. That was sloppy, reckless aiming on Stainville's behalf, and that's not something we see. That was a nice save by Stainville right there. He followed up with a really nice nade. Cooked it and everything and knew exactly where he was at. Yep, made up for it. Beautiful grenade. Taking the lead, 2-0. It's too bad it wasn't a round-winning kill, but that was a very nice nade. Excellent right there. 
2-0 right now as we got ten, Team Envy coming out the gate top. But remember, guys, we all saw what they did on Karachi. They took a 2-0 lead, and they made it go to overtime. So do not count out second nature by any means right now as Stainville once again has got lightweight marathon on, and he's running around to B. I like it. I dig it because, first of all, you never want to go and B that front route. I think he learned from that mistake in the semifinals. It is good at least if you're going to tactically approach B. It's, it's a hard angle to go at, always. I mean, you're in an airplane. It's, it's a tight, confined area. It's not the best way to go, but you have to switch it up. You can't always go A, and this is the way to do it, guys. So if you're new to game battles out here and you're watching our stream, take notes right now to Stainville. Even though he's down one player, he's going to make a move into B and see what he can do. Playing, playing a little slow, but he's getting that plan off right now. Getting that plan off. Minute 30 seconds is now going to click over to 45 seconds as he gets his bomb off. And hype is around. He's going to see that it's at B. And he's going to be coming in. The, he's debating right now. So we'll keep the player cam on Stainville right now. But um, hype is debating. And they're going to run each other right there. Oh, oh, oh he should have had that. He really should have had that. That head came up there, and he, he saw him, and he really should have had that kill. You know what happened there. And in fairness, Let me down. <laughs> He was about to move as height came up those steps. But if you run a plant there and you're going to watch one of the ends, you watch one of those ends. Don't get, don't get fickle and start moving around and be antsy. So second nature takes it 2-1 right there. Envy is still in the lead. And at least SN finally got a point on the board. Let's see what they're going to do differently. Since SN won, let's give them a player cam and switch our player camera over to not height. Let's watch Rewind. He's carrying the bomb. So Rewind is on the bomb. He's got that famous red dot that he's been doing work with. It's nothing like, who did we see last game, that a prop that was rocking the double uh, akimbo shoddy. Jeez, that got a little too out of hand for me. I like Stainville's setup here. He's over there looking inside from the outside on A, and he knows where the other player is because the other player just threw a stun nade. That's what, and I, 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 Stainville's great at that. I'm going to give him credit. He is, a, is an amazing tactician. Did you see that shot? Wait, did you see that shot from yeah. Stainville? That was incredible. Very nice shot. Nasty. Uh, what, he, too bad he couldn't have done that last game, but you know he's got he's got to, when his shot is on, you guys got to watch out for Stainville. So moving in right now, hype is a only man standing. Uh, we're gonna stick it to him and see what can happen. We'll stay on the player cam with him as he's got to find that bomb. And Stainville's watching over there. It looks like he might have saw the tail end of him as he went in there. So minute 28 seconds. He's got to make some moves right here. I don't know what's gonna happen here. The chips are definitely down for hype and second nature, but don't count them out yet as they were down last time in the series. As he takes out Stainville with a FAMAS. Nice clean shot. Saw where he was, aimed up, and now it's 1-1. So let's see if foreplay can step it up for Team Envy or if hype is going to put his team in a tie with a long shot down the terminal with a FAMAS, and he ties it, taking out foreplay. The series, again, reflecting just like map one, is now 2-2. So what's going to happen here? Do you think that... We're going to go into overtime, Patrick, and maybe Envy's going to win it. Who's going to win it? This is, this is a really tough, man. I think if Rewind steps it up here and starts helping out Hype, we're going to have a match here. I mean, I think oh, it's going to go into the final map if uh, Rewind will step up and help. So, Stainville, let's switch our player camera over to Stainville. Four play and Stainville get taken out quick. All right, guys, I'm pretty sure if you blinked your eyes or went to sit for your Dr. Pepper, you just missed that round completely. So to let you guys know, there's the round winning kill by Rewind to take it. And now, all of a sudden, very, very similar to what we saw in map one. Team Envy up 2-0. All of a sudden, Second Nature steps out of it, and now they are up 3-2. Keeping the player cam on Stainville. Sorry, guys, had to back out there real quick. Give me a, give me a little break. I'm figuring it all out still on our first broadcast. Let's see what he does here. This is where he was at last time, Patrick. I don't know. I really don't know what's going on here. Hype is camping back. He looks like he's got a little bit of a nervous twitch going on. Don't want to switch the player cam to him. Let's check out foreplay real quick. And these guys are pretty boring. It's 3-2. Uh, they I, I was expecting to be aggressive, but Stainville takes out, and it looks like he took out Hype there. So it's 2-1 right now. Rewind is the guy with the bomb rocking the Scar Silence. We got a lot of Scar fanboys out there. I, I love it. The mag's a little short, Patrick. What do you think? I have to agree. I have to agree. I mean, I like the scar too, but uh, but it, it, it's too short for me. I mean, I'm uh, I need the bullets in my gun because I, I don't have the aim that these guys have. Yeah, true. Good point. I I like to think I do on some days, but it's certainly a lie. My shot sometimes is a little terrible. 
Anyway, let's switch that player camera over to Rewind. He's got the bomb. He's in the airplane. He's close to B. Stainville in four play. Two versus one. Let's see what goes down right here as Rewind's going for the plan. Again, that minute will turn into 45 seconds after the successful plant, and beautiful grenade by four plays. He runs up to tie it, and once again, guys, you couldn't ask for a better matchup. We're going into overtime on map two in terminal. What else could you ask for, Patrick? Overtime. Nothing, I apparently. <laughs> I noticed that the kills are tied here, so it'll be interesting to see who gets defense here. And it looks so, like yep. uh, Stainville got defense. Stainville and four player on defense. So let's keep our player cam then on four play right now. Throw up a stat sheet for you guys so you can check it out real quick. Stainville with four kills, four play with three, and Hype with five, and Rewind with two. As Stainville takes out Hype, again, this is, it's, honestly, is completely replicated of what we saw last series. Right now, Envy's winning it, and let's see if they can just continue that tie and win it in overtime, or if Rewind can clutch it and put his team into a 1-1, because this is it, guys. If Envy wins this round, they win the finals, match over, game over, First place team is going to win $250, and our second place team is only going to win 86 So they're playing for a little bit of money here on the line. I love I love watching Team MV play. They're just so, they're still very methodical and they're, they're smart players. I mean, they they know that they're they're in a two-one situation here, and they're just sitting back. They don't even care if he plants the bomb. If he plants the bomb, they're still going to be okay. Let him play. Yeah, absolutely. It's I not done on defense. I mean, they got a mate right now. Is rewind sees him, takes out four play. He said, I'm not done yet with that scar silence we were talking about. He's going to get a plan on B. At, nope, nope, nope. He's waiting. Stainville is right there. We're going to see a gun battle go down if they and run you know, that's, into that's really interesting because that's, that's not the first time we saw that one-on-one -on -one happen. Game over. Like, they're always... Oh, no. He misses the grenade stun combo. Close. And now Rewind knows where he's at. He's going to try it back oh, on him. Oh, nade. And no, oh, same thing. And he hit him with the nade. He hit him with the nade. Same thing. Both done. Did a great wow. Take. I'm okay. Can't finish it up. And takes nice. him out. Nice. Rewind clutches it. We're going to game three. Play on no, invasion. No. If you remember, Patrick. And let's be honest. I, th I thought the chips were down. I thought Envy was running away with that one point, so to be I? honest. How could you not? 2-1. <laughs> I think everyone out there already might have shut up the live stream. Thought Envy won it. But we're going to a game three right now, guys. Search and destroy invasion. Just going to give you a little idea. of Team Envy lost. 0-4 to four to uh, AOX on Invasion last game. So hopefully they're talking to each other right now, figuring out what they're going to do differently for it. Josh, why don't you talk to our players, see what sides they're going to be, and we'll go from there. Fwiz. So right now, yeah, so right now, there was a tie in rounds right now because they both won a match 4-3. So we're going to find out what sides they're coming right now as Josh is going to check things out. Patrick, Search and Destroy Invasion. We saw MD play it. They got straight skunked on it. Zero to four. What are they going to have to do different from what you saw then and what they're going to have to do now? The, clearly, they're going to have to win, win their 1v1s because I, because I think they're setting up better than the other team. They, they know the maps better, and they're getting the setups on the maps better. But the problem is that when they see them, they're losing those 1v1 battles, and that's what they got to do. They see him first, and they're still losing those 1v1 battles, and that's what's killing them. Almost messed up out there again, guys, after I just told you I promised I wouldn't do it. Almost started Terminal again. We are playing Invasion. <laughs> Let's check the game rules. They're all right. Don't want to be misleading and have them start Terminal again. So, Envy has decided to choose, as you say, bottom, Josh. Bottom. All right. So, we're going to jump on board with Stainville and Foreplay. Starting the game up now. Envy's got bottom, Hype's got, or uh, at second nature, Hype and Rewind got top. Let's see what goes down here as we kick off Search and Destroy Invasion. I, no, I love this map, too. Terminal Invasion, I could just play them all day long. Let's see who we got in here. Stainville. I really want to watch, Patrick. I will right, keep it on Envy. You know, they're, they're winning. They, they, they did lose, I guess, game two. Hot Stainville or four play? I think four, I think four play is going to have more action here. He's got the long range weapon. He's looking all the way down the right side. And Stainville <laughs> and dead, enough, so definitely going to have more action. It's taken <laughs> out. So four play all alone. And to start off invasion, already looking like exactly what it looked like when AOX played it. Not looking too good for Envy right now. This is not their strong map by any means, but gets a great stun. Knows where he has. Throw one more stun. He misses that one. Sees him. 
Uh, not a clean kill by any means, and he gets taken Good out. Rounds, Rewind. Not, not smooth at all on Envy's behalf. Let's see if they can shape it up right here. Show the round winning kill and foreplay with. I hate to say it, guys, but it looked a little bit like a halo size. jump, not going to lie. <laughs> Going 1-0 right now as uh, Second Nature takes the lead oh, right Lord. now. Let's switch our player came over to Second Nature since they're doing real well, and let's put it on um, I Rocking that AK-47, no iron sights, Rambo style, got to love it. And he's going to sit back, and it looks like he's going to be watching B. Just to give you a little update for Team Envy, uh, as you can all probably imagine, Stainville's carrying the bomb right now. He is rocking Marathon in Stopping Power Pro, so he doesn't have lightweight on. So it looks like they're going to be a little bit more tactical, slow to approach, instead of their usual run-and-gun, rush and plant bomb style. As Rewind takes out Stainville. It's looking grim right now for Envy. Let's see if Fourplay can step his game up real quick and see what he's going to be able to do differently. Wow, I'm, I'm speechless here. I'm speechless here. I can't, I can't even believe what I'm seeing. I, I really thought that Team Envy was going to run away with this, and it's not looking too good for them right now, is it? No, not even remotely close. They're not, they're not playing Team Envy game right now at all. As Rewind is looking hot, and it would be unjust if we didn't put the player cam on Rewind. So we're going to put it on him. He's going to show us what's really good. As he's got a, right now, I'll read the stats off to you guys. Rewind's three and zero. Hype's one and zero, and. Envy hasn't even got a kill on the board as Rewind picks up another kill. Wow. They have gotten Envy rattled as foreplay gets taken out. And I'm wondering if Envy's even going to get a kill, let alone win this game. Wow, Envy, look at this. They're just rocking the socks off these right. guys. Like, the they're one. not even seeing them first. They, like, before they were seeing them first and they were missing their shots. They're, now they're not even seeing them first and Rewind's definitely making his shots. If he sees it, you're done because he, he's got a beast shot. For all our Game Battles viewers out there right now, Please get out a pen and paper right now and jot some notes down on what Rewind is doing because he's hot right now. Rocking that UMP45 silence, not taking any names, and he's on defense again. It looks, he's like, I'm up 3-0. I'm going to rush these guys and take them off, off surprise. He's got Marathon Lightweight on. Rewind has four play pinned right now. Yeah, absolutely. And Stainville, again, has a bomb. He did decide to put on Lightweight class right now as Rewind's going to try to hunt them both down and see if he can pick up another. I'm going to tell you guys right now, Rewind has got five kills, Hype's got one, and again, Envy has yet to kill the opponent at all. This is the last map of the finals match, two versus two, search and destroy. Winner takes it all right here. Let's see what's going to happen. Rewind just has to clean it up, two kills. It's nothing he hasn't done before like last round. Minute and 40 seconds on the clock, he's playing defense, and now he's all the way on the opposite side just trying to hunt them out and wonder where they're at. This kid is sick right now with that UMP. <laughs> Jeez, I need to, I'll tell you what, guys. You take notes, I'm going to take notes after this as well. I, I'm terrible with the UMP. Would love to see if I can shoot some guys down like this with it. 3-0 lead and body bag. I hate to say it, but it looks like uh, Second Nature might already have this one in the bag. I think you're right, Fwiz, and I, uh, it, it, it's it painful go. to watch here. I mean, yep. look, Stable's going to try to put some points up here on the board. And we'll see what happens. He's not going out with a zero out of this game. He's not <laughs> going out with a zero. Fair enough. You can't blame the guy either. He does get some points on the board with that plan. And now he's going to sit back. And I'll tell you what, that's a pretty traditional spot. So I'm hoping uh, he's got something under his sleeve back there when they come closer. So right now, the only way Andy could win it is if they clutched it like uber, uber clutch and won four straight rounds in a row. They do have a plan. Oh. 25 seconds left. He just got flashed. Take that wow. AK. And that's it, guys. After amazing game, Second Nature comes back, takes a hard 4-0 lead, and wins it all. They are our two versus two search and destroy kickoff. Modern Warfare 2 winners. Props to you, Hype and Rewind. Great game, great comeback, way not to quit. And that's it. We're going to wrap it up to a commercial break. We'll come back with a post-game talk-up. And that's it. We're Game Battles Live.
And we're back on Game Battles Live. You just saw Second Nature beat our Call of Duty 4 National Finals runner-up and Team Envy, which had four playing Stainville on it. Body bag. Close games all around other than Invasion. Invasion, they got rocked in the semifinals of 4 and got rocked in this one. Um, they might need to go play a little bit of Invasion for a little bit, huh? Well, they definitely need to get some practice in, Fwiz, because, I, you know, like I said, I mean, they're, they're, they were missing their shots on Terminal. I mean, they were seeing them first, and they were missing their shots. On Invasion, I mean, they, they didn't even get to shoot, but on Terminal, they, they were just playing out missing their shots, and they just couldn't They, they got couldn't land zero shots. kills, and just so you guys know, they did not get one kill on that final map there, which was devastating, as Rewind was just cleaning them up with that UMP. So... That's it right now. I just wanted to let you guys know this is the premier of Game Battles Live. You just saw Second Nature win the 2 vs. 2 Search and Destroy kickoff. We'll be back to bring you more Game Battles Live action in the future. Thank you for everyone viewing. Good night.